What is going on guys? Grave here today. I'd like to talk about the different controller options we have here in ESO and how I think there needs to be something added in to make it easier to uh, weapon swap while playing Elder Scrolls Online on console. By default, it's left on the directional pad, which is very, very annoying. Um, and there's different ways, of course, you can go in or can really go about changing this, but some of them will have to be either spending money on a new controller or actually going into your settings and changing those things within your console settings. So for example, on PlayStation, you can go in here on PS4, go to the settings and actually change what the buttons do on the controller. So you can kind of remap the buttons. The thing that is difficult or kind of annoying about that is no matter what game you're playing, your controller is set to that setting. So you'll have to go back in and turn it back on to default, whatever the case may be. Some people may not want to do that, but for some that do, a lot of people use you know, the right thumbstick R3 as their weapon swap button. So that way you can just click R3, your weapons will swap pretty handy because you don't have to take your hands off the thumbstick. Uh, if you're like me, I still, of course, here play on old gen on PS4. I use the PlayStation back button, which was, uh, you know, brought out about a year ago. Of course, it just clips on, gives you an option to have two buttons on the back. Uh, some people may use a scuff controller. Some people may use a battle beaver. Some people may use a razor controller. There's a lot of different options out there. And I know a lot of people on new gen uh, are using razor controllers because there's not a lot of options right now for besides battle beaver for, you know, those type of controllers on new gen consoles just yet. Uh, but the big thing in my opinion is there needs to be just some options within the game in case people don't want to, as the NPC knocks me out of my throne, that was kind of rude. But, um, as, as some people just don't want to go out and spend money on expensive controllers, some people may not want to have to swap their layout for their controller because they're going to have to, you know, they may play a lot of different games. You don't have to swap things up like that all the time. And as most of you know, the only options we have here in the gameplay is, is template A, template B, and template C. And as you can see, template A and template B do not even change the weapon swap option. And template C just puts it on triangle, which is still kind of annoying. Most people would like to have some type of option where it's putting the buttons or the weapon swap button somewhere automatically like R3, uh, L3, whatever the case may be. Something that would make it easier to change, change weapons without having to... Um, you know, use that directional pad. If you're trying to get used to weaving, trying to get faster at, at combat, you still want to be able to move around and, and, you know, be able to stay in combat. If you're having to take your thumb off the, the off the sticks to just hit a direction or hit a button or hit the, the direction on the directional pad to be able to weapon swap, it is very annoying. Of course, I don't have any gear equipped. Like I said, I have the back button. I'm sure most of you kind of hear it clicking in the background. Uh, you know, of course, I can swap easily without having to take my thumbs off the sticks. And I just wish we had an option that was automatically like that in, in the controller settings without having to go in, like I said, and change things within your console settings or have it to buy some kind of different type of controller just to be able to really get the, uh, the weapon swap mechanic to work correctly. I also think there probably could be some other things here that could be laid out a little bit differently on some of these um, default um, uh, controller settings that are in the game. I think that I know the game's old, the UI's older, um, so not all the options that are available now and all the games you can get. You know, there's so many different controller options and so many different games now, no matter what you play. I'm not sure if it would be difficult to add in. I'm probably guessing it would be, considering it's dealing with gameplay and UI and all that kind of stuff. But at the same time, I kind of wish uh, Zoss would look at this. Hopefully, they will look at this with the you know the upgraded version coming out for new gen. Uh, the enhanced version. Maybe they'll decide to do some different things with the controller options because I think anyone playing on Xbox, anyone playing on PlayStation would really like to see some changes to this. Leave me a comment with your thoughts, guys. And of course, if you like the video, hit the like. If you hadn't subscribed yet, please do so. And I'll catch you all next time. Peace.